Two things are happening today. New friends, no fams. And you know what that means, y'all. It's a bros day, studs only. I'm going to a baseball game with a few of my friends that y'all have yet to meet. Anyways, we're gonna go see the Rangers versus the Astros game, so you know it's an iconic game. First off, second, you know I gotta go rep for the home team. And what's a shame is I don't have any Rangers merch. I have Rangers hats, but as you can see, I got a situation going on up here. I know y'all want a house tour, it's coming soon. I'm gonna get my house together here soon. I got a few more pictures to hang up and I got y'all. Gotta get my Oakleys. Y'all, I'm obsessed with these Oakleys. I'll tell y'all right now, these are my favorites. And I love you so much, I'll be back, buddy. Champ really like, if you don't get your ass up out of here. I know a lot of masked people can relate to not having that many masked friends. I'm all about changing the narrative of that because I have a few masked friends. There's actually a group of us and we don't all hang out. I don't really mix my friend groups like that because everybody has their own amount of friends, you know? And at my big age, that's a lot of us. Maybe one day we'll have like a stud meetup, a mask meetup, and everybody could come through and we could kick it and cut up and do some sort of activity. That would be dope, huh? But yeah, I'm sure there are so many mass presenting people out here that can relate it isn't that hard to find mask people who are on your same wavelength i feel like people have put a bad stigma on it and myself included right i've made funny videos on tiktok that are like a parody of studs beefing with one another that has been my reality before but as you're trying to change the narrative in your life you start welcoming other things right you let your guard down and then you'll meet other people who have also let their guard down and then y'all can click and link up and cut up and have a good time together with no beat, no drama. All I'm saying is that it doesn't have to be that way. So honestly guys, look for people who are less egotistical and find the people that vibe on your vibration. Before we go to the game, we're gonna link up and go eat at this dope barbecue spot in Arlington. It's called Hurtado Barbecue. I don't know if y'all heard of it, but it is fire. Like it's so fire, even at the Ranger Stadium, they have like their whole setup there. Obviously it's going to cost three times more to eat Hurtado at the stadium versus eating Hurtado at the location. So we're gonna stop at Hurtado, have some barbecue, have some drinks, and then we're gonna go to the game. Y'all, I'm always dealing with this traffic. Let me get up at the traffic. I see y'all at Hurtado. It's hot out here. Yeah. So now I've never been here. Thank you. Y'all, we didn't know that Chanel ordered for the table. Otherwise, we wouldn't have got all this food. Um, we didn't know that you ordered for the table. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't. I, wouldn't I mean, have. I was trying. I wouldn't have. But that looks good. <laughs> Oh, uh, but I'ma still get some over there. Oh, oh, please do. You know what I'm saying? Y'all, we trying. We really are. We trying. You full? Look, you got the full look. Look, the hand in the pocket. <laughs> it's done. Done for. I'm saying. And then Chanel snuck one on me. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's good. A barbecue sauce. Uh, the meat sweat. Man, the meat sweat. <laughs> Cheers. Good, we have a masculine of center therapy sessions today, okay? A lot going on. The moral of the story is be here for one another. Yep. Speak up when you're going through yep. something. And be real with yourself. You know what I'm saying? And now we're going to go try to act like we're going to be paying attention at the baseball game. <laughs> Y'all, if we ain't the last ones to the game, I don't know who is, okay? Let's see the Rangers gear. Y'all the only ones with it, so we got to do a fit check, okay? So, I don't know which jersey this is, but... Uh, you got one. Got That's all that matters. Blue. Yeah, we got the powder blue. All right, Tree, let's see. What are we doing? What we got? We got the Ooh, fit we, check. We got yeah, the Rangers. I just Rangers. got this hat from Target. Boom. Got the Rangers shirt. You did. You know what I'm saying? Put these Nikes out. I usually cut grass in them, but I threw them in the washer because they red and let's blue. Let's go. You know what I'm saying? Not in Rangers attire at all whatsoever, but I got the Oakleys on. Okay. Champion shirt. Got these for $4 at Trader's Village. Okay. Clutch. 
Am I easy? You know what I want to get? I want to get some Jabos, y'all. I want some What Jabos. you mean? We the same age. Wait, how old are you? I'll be 40 next week. Okay, you right. Yeah. But I did wear Jabos. Okay, we got the, uh-oh, super fit check. Got the yeah. Gucci bag, Gucci. you know what I'm saying? Gucci off-white. Man, Chanel is the drippiest. Oh, I'm going to tell y'all right now. Always the drippiest. Ain't got the hair. Got the hair, man. This is a true light skin. Baby. 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 What's that? That where I'm from, we don't say baby. What y'all say? Chef. 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 <laughs> it's like a step of affirmation like oh, we trying to play with you <laughs> okay are we gonna remember which door we came out of the toyota southwest entry all right man. all right perfect let's just go down there because your restroom experience might be a little better <laughs> so now we got the hella camera up oh 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 We just got yelled at, so. <laughs> We're in the wrong elevator. She said, I work here. She said, I'm gonna get down. Employees, like chasing. We real exclusive, you heard me? We real, real exclusive. We going to another elevator. We going to another elevator to get to our designated spot. You might as well fucking have men in black with us. Where is our security? <laughs> security. We were almost there. You should have brought your glove, Trina. You should have brought your glove, dog. I knew I was on the right track. Uh -huh. I told y'all we'd be here. You sure did. So you gotta clean off your camera. You don't know. <laughs> she don't know. <laughs> Tree camera dirty. You gotta clean off your camera, Tree. Oh, yeah, clean off the lens on the back. <laughs> it'll, it'll be a little clearer. Tree shit glistening. It got a pre filter. I said we can come and go as we please. We got table number two. Oh. Uh, we have a credit. So okay. I think we got Tree coming on deck. Let's go. And, uh, we got pretty fucking good seats. I can think I, can so. I, say fucking I think so. I don't think you're supposed to say. <laughs> oh, wow. Tree, I don't think you need your glove anymore. I think you're about to get dirt kicked in your face. I'm okay. <laughs> God made dirt, dirt don't hurt. Bros night ever. What's up? It's the best bros night ever. Yeah. It's the best. 
Hey, hey. Tree browsing Instagram on her iPhone 12 Pro. No, it's my 15, motherfucker. <laughs> I'm here, yeah.